Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Super Talk with PJ uh, today. So we're going to be talking about a few things here in this uh, podcasting uh, show. It's going to be about 10 minutes. I won't do anything too crazy today. I'm just talking about everything in general. Uh, what I know so far I've been doing uh, this past week and all that today, you know. So yeah, we're going to be talking about movies, games, and then top five uh, stuff, you know. Uh, just so you know, we're going to start with uh, some gaming uh, here today. Uh, so, yeah, let's get started with uh, gaming. And then we're going to do movies, top five, and all that, like I said before. Um, but, yeah, let's go ahead and get started here today. So, the games I've been playing recently is Super Mario Bros. 3. I've been playing all the Super Mario games. It's actually pretty good. I, I'm almost finished with the game. And it's like, wow, this game gets harder and harder as it goes on. Um, but yeah, I've been playing Super Mario Bros. 3, and then I, I did try it out Super Mario World after that one. I think that's what it's called. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. I, li- I like uh, Super Mario games. And I uh, just saying, you know, uh, Seven Days to Die now has a update of 1.0 available now so you know they just recently came out with an update especially about a zombie game uh you know trying to survive and all that uh but yeah it's pretty cool uh zombie game and then um another thing is that um they do have what this one game called chain together it's pretty nice i did watch that some people played it it was it's basically about where you are chained together with your friends you know like it's like kind of of a game uh, called going to only up or something like that uh, but this time it's like you're chained with your friends or something like that. It's available on Steam. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. I did not play that one, but I, I saw people play it like um, somebody named I Show Speed and KSI. Uh, they were playing together, and it was actually pretty cool. A nice entertainment there, you know. Uh, but, yeah, those games are pretty cool. They chained together. And then, um, other than that, it's, that's pretty much it on my uh, gaming section here. Um, because I got, like, so many different games here to play, you know? It's like, my oh my, I'm just gonna play one game at a time, you know? Alright, so let's go on to movies here today, because I want to talk about a movie that I've been watching recently. And, uh, yeah, it's gonna be, uh, pretty interesting. So the latest movie I watched was Twisters. That movie came out not too long ago. And so, you know, it did come out in the top of box office. Uh, the first weekend when it came out was, like, over 80 million, which was pretty cool. I mean, I did enjoy it, uh, just so you know. There's gonna be some spoilers alerts here. Now, so you know, um, when I watch this movie, they don't have no cow, flying cows. They have flying chickens. Uh, this time, they don't have the suck zone. You know, that uh, crazy guy, Dusty, when he talks about the suck zone. They don't have any of that. Uh, just so you know, this movie's basically, basically, it's on its own movie. So, it's like a remake from the original uh, Twister. And I gotta say, it's far from better uh, movie today. It's pretty good. Uh, just so you know, this is definitely a separate s- a story uh, from the original. Because, uh, just so you know... They don't have any cameos in the movie or anything like that, except for, um, what's his name, Bill Baxton's son was in it, it was pretty cool, uh, it was, like, a very short scene that he was in there, uh, you have to, like, really watch closely, you know, I can't really explain it, but, um, yeah, it was a pretty good little movie, uh, today, I'm definitely gonna give this movie a, uh, solid 9 out of 10, uh, because it's definitely one of my favorite movies of the summer so far, uh, then, I know Deadpool is coming out here soon, I'm pretty excited to go see Deadpool, uh, I'm, I'm, like, super excited on that one, uh, because it's been a while since we had a very good movie when it comes to Marvel, but, um, yeah, this one is definitely gonna be a, uh, good m- movie to watch, uh, this Deadpool versus Wolverines. So, now we're gonna talk about top 10 grossing superhero films today. I figured I wanna share some of this because today because I found this on Google today. So, according to Google, I'm going to do top 10 uh, grossing uh, superhero films. Okay, so the first one is going to be Avengers in the game with almost uh, 2 with uh, two billion, almost a 3 billion, which is a lot of money. It's not a million, it's a, um, a B. Uh, and this movie came out back in 2019. Uh, so, yeah, it was pretty good. I did enjoy in the game and then the and then the second one is 
Avengers Infinity War uh, with a two billion uh, grossing. It's like man, back in 2018, yeah, that's that's pretty insane. And then Spider Man No Way Home number three is almost two billion. It's like 1.9 uh, billion, something like that. And then the Avengers number four is one billion. Uh, that's pretty pretty high in numbers up there. Uh, so yeah, these movies around came out like almost ten years ago. It's like man, time for sure does fly by quickly, you know. And then number five, Avengers: Age of Ultron, one billion. And then Black Panther, the original, one point three billion. And then Incredibles two was one point two billion. I forgot about that movie, Incredibles two. That one was a pretty good little cartoon uh, movie. And then um, Iron Man 3 was 1.2 billion back in 2013. And then number 9 was Captain America Civil War, 1.1 billion. And then Aquaman was 1.1 billion as well. So yeah, those are my uh, uh, top 10 according to Google. Uh, Superhero uh, Crossing films yeah that's pretty crazy how much money they make going for these movies you know uh to me i don't think i would ever become a an actor uh when it comes to filmmaking uh to me i probably would do like voice acting you know uh voice acting that's the only thing i would do over uh live action um but you know but that's just me so yeah that's pretty much it on my uh top 10 uh grossing superhero films today so the next thing i want to talk to you guys about today is uh let's see tv shows now so you know with these tv shows that's coming up here uh like a tv show called all of us are dead or squid game uh two season two i uh, just so you know they are coming out this fall uh for these shows on netflix today and the ones that i'm really looking forward to is squid game 2 and then I'm also looking forward to All of Us Are Dead. Oh, and there's one more show called Alice in Borderland too, too as well. Um, because they're also going to come out with a, a new season, I believe. Um, but yeah, all these shows are pretty good. I've been watching a lot of different things on uh, Netflix. Now, the shows that I really want to watch right now is... I'm thinking about rewatching all The Walking Dead again. And then watch uh, Kobai... K-A-I or something like that. And then another show I would like to watch is uh, Sweet Home, All-American, uh, Land of Bad, I think. Okay, no, wait, that's a movie, sorry. Um, but yeah, all these TV shows and movies on Netflix right now is pretty good. Uh, I would definitely recommend uh, some of these. And uh, so you know, Warcraft is also on Netflix right now, if you are into Warcraft game. Uh, but yeah, that was also a pretty good movie to watch too. But other than that, that's pretty much it on my TV shows and movies on uh, Netflix today, for today. So there's one more thing I would like to talk to you guys about today, uh, about the world news. It's like a crazy extreme weather. Uh, so I figured why not do this today. Now, the latest thing I saw on the news was over in Italy, they have a Mount Etna volcano has erupted. So yeah, um, over there in Italy, a volcano has erupted over there, which is kind of crazy. It's, they say it's like a massive eruption at Europe's largest active volcano, Mount Etna, Etna in Italy. So yeah, it's pretty cool, crazy. I mean, I know volcanoes are pretty cool and scary and dangerous, but you know, it's uh, it is what it is, you know. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna do a uh, Bible verse here today. I want to read in. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to read in. Um, I guess Isaiah chapter 44, chapter 44, verse 17. Okay, so it says, uh, and the rest of it he, he makes into a god. He, he is carved image. He fell down before it and worshipped it, prays to it, and says, Deliver me, for you are my God. Something like that. But yeah, that's what it says in Isaiah 44, chapter 17 uh, today. It's out of my uh, New King James Version Bible uh, today. But um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it today, guys, about my uh, podcasting video. It's been about 10 minutes today. And um, I guess that's pretty much it today. And I want to say thank you for listening. And I'll talk to you guys uh, next time.